about YouTube, how's it going? I'm Noisy, or Alex. Um, today I'm going to do a GIMP tutorial on how to um, add a watermark to your image. So I got a very simple image from Google Images. I'm going to hit Control Z. And, um, but yeah. So what I'm going to do is open the text tool, and I'm just going to do a very simple font that I like. How about Bada Boom BB? And... So let's type it. Let's just say water mark. And you can see that's very small. That's very, very small. Can't even read it until you zoom up pretty really cl pretty close. But um anyway. Yeah. So now what we would just do is hit this arrow right here. Or you can hit those arrows I could say. That is really thick. I didn't mean for that to happen. Um, anyway. With those arrows right there. But yeah. So let's just say watermark. And I'll press the up arrow. So you can see it pretty large. Let's change the color to white. Okay. And I'm just going to make it look fancy. So alpha to selection. Um, let's see. We can do. We can grow it really quick. Let's just make it pretty big. And um, then I can take this and. It's already black. And I can just add a little border to it, I guess. It probably won't show as well. But you can see that I'm adding a border to it a black border, a colored border. And then, then what you want to do is, you want to, since I've already have this right here selected, you want to use the opacity function, um, right here, opacity, it says right here, and you can use these arrows once again to change it from... 100 down so now we're just gonna throw this down it's gonna go way I'm gonna throw it way down and you can see it's already a watermark just like that and let's just throw another text over here a little G or whatever make it pretty small so you can't see it if you look at it pretty close it will just alpha that to selection so that way you can't see the alpha selection and it says watermark you can make the opacity less by simply clicking this and bringing it down a little more that's a little too much i think it doesn't matter but um... yes guys that is how you um... make a watermark and i guess we can save it as a uh, You can see I got this by Google Images. Actually, if you go down here, you can see I got it. But, um, yes, and I uh, hope this tutorial helped. And if you have any more GIMP tutorial questions, I will be happy to answer them. Um, thank you for watching, and bye.